Hello fellow spooks and spookettes, my name is Spookasaur, and welcome back to Layers of Fear. The game has been updated, thankfully, so now I don't have to um, record without a webcam because now they have a windowless mode that is supported, so now I can use other programs to record. So that's all fine and good. Um, Let's get back into it though, because this is a game I've been wanting to play, like for a while ever since I first played it a few weeks ago and now that it's got an update I've got more of a reason to play it especially now that the options are made a little bit easier for me uh don't tell me it crashed if it crashed we're gonna have issues no come on okay okay good All right, so we're right back into it. Locked. I'm trying to remember exactly where I was last. Um, Cause it's all a little bit hazy cause I played this a couple weeks ago. Uh, here, okay, nothing. And uh, nothing. Or you could just not, okay, there we go. Jeez. Is there anything here? Nope. <laughs> I'm enjoying this way too much. Okay. What is this? Deep breaths. Remember, you're professional. It's just the first few strokes. Then you're over the hump. What's so hard about it? Well... It's a baby being eaten by a bird. That's not disturbing. <coughs> oh, sorry about that, everyone. Sorry if that shows up a little loud. Uh, this is where shit starts to get fucked up. That's ah, creepy. Even though I know it's a deer head, it's just kind of creepy that it's just... In this type of atmosphere where things can go horribly wrong. And nothing here. You know, I have a staring contest? Oh, that was weird. Your fucking head is lighting up. Do you have anything for me? No. Is there anything in here? No. Nope. Of course not. Do I just move on to the other room then? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. Oh. We're right back into this. Tiny bit to the left. Yes. Just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> okay. Paint deep lies. Huh. bit laggy in the frames for me for some reason, which is weird because my settings aren't that high, but we'll deal with it. Oh. oh. A rat just... Okay! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I can't believe that got me. That was creepy. Jesus. Random crumpled shirt. The sound is really good in this game. Like, I am a huge fan of sound in horror games. I think it's one of the elements that really nails the atmosphere of 
these types of games. Alright. What's in here? Any more books gonna come flying at me? Oh no. Oh no. She's been at it again. Earlier in the day I found more of her reviews. Little notes stick to one of my or er, stuck to one of my latest paintings. Some of the most seething hateful shit I've ever some of this writing is really hard to read so I apologize if it's taking me a little bit some of the most seething hateful shit I've ever read about my work I guess I shouldn't be surprised after all she knows me well enough to know what really gets to me I just can't believe she would use that against me worst thing is when I confronted her about it she claimed she hadn't written any of them like I can't tell her handwriting Jesus does she really hate me that much, or is her mind starting to slip? I just don't know what to do anymore. Oh god. Do I choose death? Or do I choose death? Or do I choose death back there? Well, it's locked, so I can't choose death there. That wasn't creepy or anything. No, not at all. It's just a kitchen. It's just a kitchen, guys. Although, garlic hanging on the doors. Are there vamp... Um... Are there vampires? No, thank you! Whoa, okay! I cannot see a damn thing. Oh, it's brick. What am I supposed to do? What the hell? What is going on? First, I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. I had to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Ah! Booze helped keep my hand steady. Ah! Okay, then. Whatever you say, dude. Whatever you say. Oh, not this shit again. Oh, God. What happens now? Oh, okay. Started to change. Are those flamingos? Looks like some sort of bird. It almost looks like flamingos because it's kind of pinkish red in color. There's the long legs. The head's kind of shaped like it, but weird. Okay. First, I looked for a canvas. Oh, that's the. Okay. That's what we read earlier. Oh, I think I get what's going on here. When you find certain key pieces, I think each of these unlocks down to the final one, and then I'm not sure what happens. 
Shapeless Dreams. That's really neat. Okay. So there is some sort of progression that's going on here. We have to delve deeper into this House of Nightmares. Elevator. Freaky shit tends to happen in elevators, so... Um... Ah, this is just a house of nightmares. This is just nightmare fuel. Or make sure there's no door behind me. <laughs> think this is the stop. It's weird for me getting used to the push-pull mechanics because I haven't really played any games like Amnesia or anything that uses that type of mechanic to open or close things. So, it's a little weird for me, but I'm sure I'll adjust. I'm just not clicking precisely or not doing an... What the fuck? Why? Why is this painting here again? Am I gonna run into some deep nightmarish shit? Well, that's fun. Why did you stop? That dude was perfect. Honey, please, just a little longer. At least until I finish painting this one part. Oh, don't make me beg. Anything in there? No. This has got some weird, ripply shit going on here. Oh, it's changing. That's creepy. I have to say, I really like this game. The art is amazing. Why did it... Why did it go all dark and gray? Whoa, okay. Calm down, frames. Calm down, frame rate. Okay, hold on a sec. I need to see. This helps. Am I frozen here? I think I'm frozen here. Maybe it's just changing the setting on me.
Come on. If I would have known it was going to take that long, I wouldn't have done it. Would have just kept going. Are you serious? Well, I might have to end the episode here, then come back to it, which sucks, but I can't sit here and wait for this. It just locked me out of everything. Like, what am I supposed to do? I guess just exit it. <sighs> Alright, I think I'm going to have to end this here. Um, I apologize if this episode's a little shorter than it needs to be, but we discovered more about the story and what's going on here. Um so far the house is pretty crazy i love the artwork i'm glad they added in more settings so the game looks to be a lot better so expect more here shortly um expect a lot more videos of this and um expect them to be more frequent because i'm starting to find my rhythm with um how i have to manage my time and everything with classes and whatnot so uh anyway uh thank you all for watching um if you liked the video, consider subscribing and uh, favoriting the video. Um, don't forget, though, if you do subscribe and become a Spooker Spookette, you need to interact with the channel. Because otherwise, if you don't interact, then the videos will no longer show up in your feed. So then you won't know when I post a new video. Um, I'm sorry, that's just how YouTube works um, now, I guess. So, um, just remember to interact if you do subscribe. Um, and anyway, um, this has been a fun episode, and I will see you all in the next video. Remember to stay spooky. Later.